So you've been suspecting it for a long time before you even started that investigation. But can you talk about how exactly did that article come about that particular investigative uh, process? Uh, it was the pipeline was blown up in late late um, in late um, September, September the 26th. Mm -hmm. And I don't know why the president decided then. I did a lot of work on that. And I think at that time, it was becoming clear that at best, the Ukraine war that he sponsored, we've put now $113 billion into the war so far. And that's just by the government's count, not counting the money that came from Germany and Western and NATO and, this, and other countries in the Western Union. The only suspect um, in terms of talking, uh, discovering the obvious uh, was the United States, if you knew something about the history of the pipeline, something about the oil business, as I do, and I did, I still do, not much, but enough. And so I see people, you know, I've been doing stories without naming sources um, for the New York Times and the New Yorker magazine and the London Review of Books. When I worked at the New York Times, I must have written a dozen stories about CAA wrongdoing in Chile against Allende, spying on its own citizens in violation of the law that set it up. 